cultural intelligence is different because it's based on a specific theoretical foundation. Sternberg and Detterman's work on the multiple loci of intelligence. That gives us a basis for identifying four different dimensions of cultural intelligence and arguing that each of those four dimensions is a capability that can be enhanced. In other words, CQ is malleable, making it particularly relevant to educators because they can influence the CQ of their students. There's published, peer-reviewed validity evidence that the psychometric characteristics of the cultural intelligence scale are highly rigorous. It has a stable factor structure, there's evidence of incremental validity, there's also evidence of predictive validity. Unlike many other measures of cultural competence, CQ has incremental predictive validity for non-self-report outcomes. It predicts performance as evaluated objectively. It predicts supervisor-rated performance and peer-rated performance when the situation involves cultural diversity. It also predicts creativity, collaboration, trust, cultural judgment and decision-making, negotiation effectiveness, leadership effectiveness. I could go on and on. But in sum, we have a lot of confidence in CQ based on the theoretical foundation and the strong empirical work.